I'll be talking about this book called Legion. It is the last and third book in the Divergent trilogy, and af it's after Divergent and Insurgent, respectively. The author of these books is Veronica Roth. I'll start with a quote from the book. <clears throat> there are so many ways to be brave in this world. Sometimes bravery involves laying down your life for something greater than yourself or for someone else or someone else. Sometimes it involves giving up everything you have ever known or everyone you have ever loved for the sake of something greater. I chose this quote because since it was a very meaningful one and I also chose this quote because it is related to my theme which you will know later on. So the main characters in this book are Tris and Tobias aka Four. For this book the narrators for each chapter changes from either Tris or Tobias, so that you can see matters from their own point of view. This is different from the past two books, whereas only Tris is narrating the whole book. <coughs> so the um, book takes place after the different factions are shattered, and worse, the whole city is ruled by the fashionists led by Evelyn Johnson, Tobias' mom, who's claimed to be dead. When Tris is invited to join a group of rebels against the factionist government known as the Allegiance, she's told that she's able to bring her friends who are also against the new government with her. At a secret meeting with the Allegiance, she and her group of friends are chosen to explore outside the city fence beyond Amity's um, former factory and farm. As the group are passing the farm, they find a running train, which leads them to a place known as the Bureau. And there, Trish finds out that the city where she lived is called Chicago, and her mother is from the Bureau. <coughs> there are a lot of questions that are unanswered, such as, were the Bureau actually responsible for the attack simulation in the first book, which had led to the destruction of the factions. The theme which you might be wondering about is sacrifice for the greater good. This is because Tris and Tobias would give up almost everything for a brighter future for everyone. I would hugely recommend this book to anyone who loves sci-fi. And yeah, um, please, please be sure to check out the other two books for this, before you read this, otherwise you will not understand the full story and this will conclude my book talk.